Yo, what's up guys? This is Astronox and I'm back with another Tales of Aaron video. So, Lorena plus 10. Uh, here are my stats. I'm going to do a uh, win massive battle uh, abyss difficulty. And I'll show you uh, this, uh, this team in action. It's actually uh, very stable. Well, you actually have to pay attention because... Well, when this boss does the ultimate that shoots energy balls, it uh, it hurts. Now, the reason why I'm using Garcia is because with Garcia, he actually taunts the boss and makes it so the energy ball are not not being shot at the team uh, randomly. It they're all going to be focused into Garcia, so that is very helpful. <clears throat> now, uh, this is Lorena. Uh, in action, you can see her uh, damage over time is ticking for 11,000. I'm just using triple star uh, title right now for the survival for the HP increase. I have the uh, what is it, 33% skill damage increase for fire characters. Um, title from Lorena plus 10. Here they are. Boom, boom, boom. Heal. Uh, he can actually survive it. I think you saw his HP was like what 68,000. Uh, Garcia is plus zero, so I'll show you the, def uh, the, the his defense after the gear on the, the whole team. But having taunt makes this battle a joke compared to uh, having the energy ball just being random, randomly shot at your whole team and then losing uh, your damage leader, your support, whatever in the back line. Th that was just terrible. But uh, Lorena is extremely strong. Really glad I got her finally. And uh, definitely was worth the save. It took a bit more time here for, for the heal. You can just pop the heal uh, when your tank gets to uh, half HP, it's fine. Uh, you can you can just use Chloe too for uh, she taunts and uh, she can do uh, Garcia's job. Uh, Garcia provides HP for the whole team, and uh, he uh, can heal himself with skill one. Chloe's for free, so yeah. Use whoever you have that can taunt. There are other heroes, of course. Yeah, easy peasy. Just gonna open this up. Just need to get more uh, illusory Nirvana costume that affect humans. Uh, the, the fire one. And uh, so yeah, there's the Utega event uh, that's up again. And I'm just like farming it as much as possible. Uh, I got like a thousand, I don't know, thousand five hundred saved up. Uh, maybe I can get fire claws with uh, T4 origin claws with uh, nice substats uh, or uh, wind claws or wind tome. Or fire tome, which I could uh, just replace whatever I got for better stuff. This is actually quite a bit of damage on the back line with that skill. So six minutes, I did the bulk of the damage, and I mean I didn't I didn't have uh, defense down for the whole. Th thing just at the end when I opened it up but yeah healing divinity makes this thing uh, much easier especially because I mean the energy balls are focused into the tank oh, actually I need to form better uh, the a third fire god's layer of origin you can pause if I go too quick for the substat this has good substat though that's why I'm still using it and not rushing into uh, oh yes uh, okay gear first and then the uh, character 
stats. You can get Petrolia from the rounds of characters now. 5,000 summon emblems. Mirafuse is in the pool as well. So very good for players who didn't have her. Uh, Petralia is uh, extremely flexible in any uh, team element. So yeah, look at this. Crit damage. Oh my. It's so good. True Red Melody. Garcia is ready for tanking. So he, you saw his defense, 5100, 68,000 health. Petralia, I need her to be plus 3 uh, origin so I can uh, advance her in the Cosmos. Get her to level 120. No problem with Nefiru, she's plus 6 already. I got lucky with pulling uh, when pulling. And yeah, working on her Cosmos and Lorelei's Cosmos. So, uh, yeah, getting uh, lower, li lower life uh, 120, level 120, and if you wrote level 120 is uh, the goal now. But uh, I'm not going to forget about my win team because uh, it's most likely going to be the element you need for the next Guild War. Uh, nothing's confirmed, but I'm going to go check again for, um, before the next video. And, uh, yeah, win team has uh, 1 .1, over 1.1 million powers, just that it's missing... Uh, Nirvana costume that affects humans. Fire team is very close behind though, which is good. So I can have my fire team farm costumes for my wind team, and then the wind team farms costume for my uh, water team, and my water team can, well, eventually farm costume for my fire team. Or I can just use my fire team for uh, the fire uh, abyss massive battle. It's just that I'm gonna have to deal with the damage over time uh, before the boss breeds so I don't get my whole team wiped out. I could just bring uh, like Shiro that removes damage over time. Just have Lorelei pure like damage dealer in there and uh, I can just replace uh, Nefiru because Nefiru dispels but doesn't remove damage over time. She dispels one debuff. Uh, the boss actually applies what is it? Attack down or defense down on the uh, on your team? Something like that. Uh, yeah, I guess that's it. That was just uh, to quickly show you what's up with the fire team. And uh, yeah, the Utega event here. Yeah, almost 1500. Uh, I got the origin uh, fruit, so I got uh, lower light to plus 10, and I was able to uh, yeah, get a bunch of rewards back. And there is a drum that you can get. I actually didn't pull yet from the vault. I could definitely just pull now. Yeah, just just uh, I'm gonna go and pull now, just to uh, just a few times. You see. 190, get a drum, just pull real quick. If you get copies of Utega, unfortunately, you don't get a thousand summon emblems like before. I think it was nerfed to like 30, 30 or 40 now. I got Utega like one time, I think, so far. Ah, wait, no, I got Utega twice now, so far. Maybe I got more copies of her i mean uh, utega is plus 10 already anyways it's been she's been plus 10 uh, plus 10 for since the first time this event happened uh but yeah i got two extra copies that i noticed uh i mean i've been watching uh movies doing other things and just uh having the game run but uh yeah i pretty much see the reward screen uh, most of the time this is a great uh, time for you to get uh, wind and uh, fire costumes for your teams as well as a bunch of other good stuff uh, so definitely work on that this was the the event that made me uh, create my wind team uh, in between two guild wars where uh, wind team were not required and I had 
the gear ready so I'm just like yeah exciting stuff I'm just gonna build my win team and really liking it uh, just hope they release uh, more uh, heroes soon enough but yeah I really like fire team is uh, you know my, my first team and I'm really liking fire especially now with Lorelei so I don't know what's gonna happen but uh, it's gonna be a human team uh, later down the line uh, so yeah, any human hero uh, characters are gonna be part of it. So yeah, that's it for this one guys. Thanks for watching. I'm Astronox. Like, comment and subscribe for more. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace out for now.